We're out at Lake Beulah tonight and mom and I are experiencing yet another newborn baby we call our sunsets. This is a beautiful shot that was taken on Sunday, the 27th of June. Nice calm waters here tonight. And uh, just uh, the serenity and beauty of a sunset in western Waukesha. Actually, this is uh, more like Walworth County. Lake Beulah in all of its sunset glory. What a shot. What a beautiful evening to witness the sunset on a beautiful day, a Sunday in late June, 2021. You can hear the Cardinal calling a little bit. That's what that sound is. And then every once in a while you'll see uh, photo bombing across the screen are swallows. And these barn swallows are constantly out looking for a meal. They flicker and they flop and they turn on a dime looking for another meal of mosquito or gnat, whatever seems to be moseying around in the atmosphere near the lake because this is a very clean lake. It is just gorgeous uh, sea to the bottom and uh, there's a couple vessels out there. I think maybe you can see one right in the camera there. I got it as zoomed in as I can. There's like maybe three or four boats on the tonight on the evening, uh, the evening waters to capture and witness and really enjoy the beauty, the serenity, the calm. Now this area does have a couple of restaurants near the, the road that is near the lake. There's another pontoon boat puttering out to take a view. Spectacular sunset. Boats are mainly docked tonight. It's Sunday, you know, the frolicking and fun was this weekend. Yeah, it was a little bit cloudy yesterday with some drizzle. It has been dry here in western Waukesha County and Walworth County, but for the most part, we're rebounding well. On the drive out here to the lake, we're about eh, 15 minutes or so, 20 minutes from the lake. We saw the crops are really rebounding. The corn, soybeans, we see the very beginnings of some of the plantings of sunflowers, but mainly corn and uh, soybeans are the main crops here that the farmers have along with um, many, many horse farms. There's horse farms all along the way out here, as well as many small homesteads. You know, the old farms from back in the day that have been converted into, you know, self-sustaining homesteads have got Upcoming will be the sweet corn season. That'll be soon. And then there also, um, you can drive in to an area farm and get fresh harvested beef, pork, lamb, rabbits, chickens, of course, and chicken eggs. Mmm, eggs. Right now, you can get two dozen eggs for $5. It's a roadside stand. They're fresh every day. You know, they're the multicolored type of eggs. They're not the, you know, typical store-bought where they're white. You get eggs here that have, it's almost like, um, you know, not a rainbow of colors, uh, but there's light brown, brown, blue, green. Very few white eggs uh, that you see. It's really quite a, fascinating. And the taste is just, we had, we cooked up some lamb yesterday and before that we um, cooked up a couple days ago some of the meat that we had recently purchased from a farm it was delicious slow cooked to perfection you could cut the filet with a fork and a butter knife it was just delicious just fell off uh, the cutting board it was delicious and that's what you get here you know you're if you're looking around, you can find uh, partners in the natural food area. We're trying to avoid 
driving into town, you know, the corporate supermarket world and try to find farm fresh. Farm fresh, that's, i to give you a little peek of what's happening across the street here. Again, it is Sunday. It's about 8.30 p.m. There's a couple of nice little restaurants down there. Two in a row, and then a third one there on the corner. But again, you can see by lack of cars in the parking lot that it's a quiet evening. Usually that place is hopping. Usually it's hopping. Yeah, they got, they got some noise. People are chattering outside on the deck, enjoying their Miller lights oh, and uh, delicious fare. Friends of ours live on this lake. Good people, people that we've known for years and years. In fact, I worked for uh, the gentleman back in the day. Yeah, back in the mid 80s. And um, involved with some really, really giving back to, you know, society as far as uh, nonprofits. We're, we're involved with those as well. But it's about the beauty tonight. It's about the serenity of this absolutely gorgeous sunset. Hand painted by the Lord. Yeah. There's a swallow coming through. Kind of look quick. They come, they come barging through on the, on the screen, uh, unannounced, looking for a meal. <laughs> See that beauty? Something you just love. You know, it's just timeless. It's a timeless experience. Slowly but surely, the sun slips away in the west. Our friends that are west of us here, our customers that go beyond Wisconsin West, uh, enjoying the sunset on the Sunday evening. Hope you're enjoying it as much as we do. And uh, wanted to share this with you as these couple of boats are slowly coming in to Dockside. They've, they've seen the spectacular ending of a beautiful day. And now just, uh, you know, settling back and getting things in order because tomorrow, Monday, we hit it again, right? Make society work. Until then, on behalf of my lovely wife, we'll see you again. We'll talk to you soon. Bye now, everybody.